There is a hot issue which has become controversial in Africa. And the question is, was Jesus white or black? Why are we even entertaining this? Because other people will not stop asking this question. And some have made it an excuse for not accepting Christ as their Lord and Savior. Some have labeled Christianity as a white man's religion. It was impossible for Jesus to come as a multicolored human being. He had to be one of the colors, and regardless of his color, some people of other colors would still reject him for being different. Could you answer this question honestly and sincerely? If you were on a free fall falling from a mountain, and all of a sudden you were caught by a very strong hand, while you're still dangling, would you be asking a question like, what color of hand is the one holding me? Obviously, your first reaction will be, help me, pull me up. After they pull you up, your reaction will be that of gratitude. The first words that will probably come out of your mouth is, thank you. So why do you question what color brought salvation to you? Salvation is no color. It's a matter of life and death. Accept your salvation and say thank you. If you were swimming in a pool in Cape Town and you started drowning, and a white man sees you drowning and he rushes to you in a jet ski, would you ask him if he's a racist before you accept his help? So why is it an issue if God sent Jan van Riebeek or Simon van der Stel to bring the Bible to Africa? When the Israelites were slaves in Egypt, God sent Moses, who was brought up by Pharaoh, the oppressor, while other Hebrew boys were slaughtered. The same boy who grew up in the house of the oppressor and was educated by the oppressor was sent by God to save the Israelites from slavery. The paramount consideration is that Jesus is the Son of God. The pivotal debate should center on whether Jesus is indeed the Son of God. Interestingly, some individuals from the African diaspora suggest they could more readily accept Jesus if he were depicted as black. However, this is not universally true. As many Caucasians, despite Jesus being portrayed as white by religious institutions, still refuse to believe in him. Notably, Jesus' own Jewish community rejected him. So stop trying so hard to convince black people that Jesus was black so that they may believe in him. They will still not believe in him. We still have a lot of black people who don't believe in African religions. So this is not about race, it's about faith. Preach about the love of God and the God who loves people regardless of their race or color. I don't deny that Jesus could have been any color. He was born in the Middle East, where there were Jews, Blacks, Whites, Arabs, Indians, and more. So let's say someone proved beyond a shadow of doubt that Jesus was indeed Black. So now the other races may also reject him based on his Black color. Personally, I don't really care which color Jesus was. I believe him based on his love for me. The sacrifice he made for all people of all races is good enough for me. God is a spirit. What color is a spirit? I don't know. So I believe him in whatever color it may be. Jesus once said to Thomas, They are more blessed, those who believe, even when they have not seen. So there is a blessing in believing in God whom you have not seen. Faith is about believing. Anyone who looks for tangible evidence will miss salvation. It does not matter if he is black or white, we believe in him. Some people argue that white people brought Christianity to Africa and they are the oppressors. So if Jesus happened to be white, they have nothing to do with his salvation. This is actually hypocritical because the same people embrace technology that came with the oppressors. They embraced education. They embraced fashion. They have copied dressing styles from all over Europe and uh, the U.S. The history in the Bible is not about Europeans and Americans. 
it's about the Middle East. The reason why the Bible came to Africa from Europe is because Europeans had the technology to duplicate Bibles in large numbers. Believing in Jesus is not a political affiliation. It's not a race thing. Personally, I believe in Jesus in whatever color it may be. I preach the Jesus who saves. I preach the Jesus who loves people. Those who believe in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. Believe in Christ Jesus. Stay blessed.